We can find out in Kakarot the origins of Raditz's wrestling background. But before then, we'll say, Hello everyone, are you ready for another adventure? It's me, Wookie, and I'm here with my brother, Nux. Hello. And we're here to beat Nero Fest. We are not going to be able to finish these last ones. I'm too busy with so many shit that it's unbelievable. And I still actually need the grindy event itself. Um... But we can definitely do these final two Nero fights, and that's what we're gonna do today. Starting with the easier version, and then the much harder version. Let's go. Are you ready, boy? Not really. Now here's the question, uh, do we use the same team for both fights? I don't know. I, don't, I think we should go in with different things each time. Alright, fair enough. <clears throat> Let's start. Who should we have? So obviously, what I remember from this fight is... Cause this was infamous. This is why there's a changed one. If we, if we don't, if we kill Nero or we don't kill Nero, something happens and she makes every single person invincible on the team. Yeah. So we have to essentially kill the final group all at the same time. Okay. Otherwise, we're gonna have a lot of bad times. So we have to actually take this semi-serious as we look for what supports do we use. Okay. So, what, what are we thinking? Hmm. I think we need an all-around good caster. Because this is the serious fights. We're going to serious territory. Yeah, serious time. Serious fights. Castoria, I guess, would be the safest pick out of any caster. Yeah, next, probably the only safer one would be probably Merlin. Yeah, but there's no Merlins on your screen, so... No. No one using Merlin but you. Next. That's why I'm cool. Yeah, well, pretty cool. Are one of the cats freaking out? I think that is a kid screaming. Okay, as long as it's not one of our cats, I'm cool. Um, hmm. Again, it's Nero. I remember Ozzy's in this fight. Ozymandias? Ozymandias, yes. So I'm wondering if for a main damage dealer, do we go for someone with a lot of attack? Or do we go for someone that can take out um, a berser like a berserker type dude? For AoE status. If that's mm. the case, then the obvious answer here would be to use just... Uh, Musashi, but Musashi dies very quickly. Yeah, because she has the entire thing that halves her HP, you know? Mm -hmm. Even if she does gain guts, it's uh, pretty risky still. So let's see. Um, I think in terms of just pure goodness, I think I'm going to go with... My level 100 MP5, uh, oh, Artoria. Summer Art Artoria. Yes, okay. there's not, there's never been a more serious moment than this pick. All right, what do you go, boy? For go for, boy. We gotta get another support in. Sadly, he still don't got no Merlin. We don't got no Merlin. But we go for the healer. Go caster. Uh huh. Go down. Do you not have? Yeah, you do. But he's level 60. Ooh, I was gonna the... go As Asclepius. It's fine, we can go Asclepius. Okay. He, he may be level 60, but two of his skills are level 10. Okay, so you're somewhat prepared for this. Somewhat, and he's MP4. So um, he's probably gonna need that Guts. This he, one? He does give Guts for his NP, but in case he goes down pretty quick. Alright, we'll do this, and this way he also has a buttload of attack along yeah. with it. Let's see, for in case things go bad... What's a unit that would be good for picking up in case things go bad? Let's see, again, with the idea that Nero is Archer, Archer. Uh, Saber, my bad. Hmm, someone that can kind of just, like, stand their own. No so, relation. Or Orion or Orion? Orion would be a pretty good pick in case things go really bad. He can survive as well. Yep. I mean, yeah, we'll go with Orion. You just gotta be careful with how much stuff we're putting on people. Yeah, alright. Okay. What about next? This is probably either another support or another just in case things go bad. We're gonna go... We're gonna go back to the past. Samurai Jack. We're gonna go special classes. Mm-hmm. And I'm thinking we do some... We're, we're only worrying about Nero, which is what we shouldn't be worrying about. So maybe like an alter ego would work here. Okay. I was thinking... You have both Mecha Ellie's, I doubt, with any of their skills up. 
Level one, level one. This one has a little bit more in her. Level six, level eight, and level four. She has a lot of determinants on her, but I think it's fun to use units you're not used to using. So Mecha Ellie? And Mecha Ellie Mark II. Go with the Mark II, and we'll go for some more damage. And now we've got just enough space for MASH. Designated MASH. Designated MASH Driver. Can she run? Ooh, could she potentially have this? She can. She has her well, own. We have a full team of the damage seeds. First time. Yes. Now, we don't have an AoE, so really a lot of the carrying here is going to be have to be done by uh, uh, Summer Saber over here. So let's go into it and see how this goes. Again, other than Nero, I don't remember much about this fight, but I do remember this fight being a pain in the ass. And it's probably the only one that's kind of legit, but this is the easy version. Yeah, this isn't the super hard one. The one that they nerfed is the second one. Is the the, the one that comes after this. Oh, I can I think it's because they have break bars now. Or like No, they don't have break bars. Or They're just nerfed. Break bars. They just the what 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 they were doing was changed. It it's it's just specific things. That's the one that I forgot. It's this one. She gets her NP like every two turns. I think she NPs in like two turns. Who? Okay. Jack. She gives us buff block. That's the other thing. Ooh, that sucks. Three left, but it's okay because we have three at least. And missed Artoria at the end. Yeah, because she has Divinity, I think. So let's see. Uh, can we see if they have anything here? Nothing yet. Uh, okay. So, so the, we're this? already starting off pretty bad with a Lancer on field. Yes, we are. We have to deal with it, and I think we can deal with it with an MP, to be honest. Maybe. But we also needed a, bit, a way to buff her. And we don't have... Removes debuffs for all allies. Never mind. We can just use this. Okay. Yeah, that removes it. <laughs> okay. Simple um, enough. Yes. Do we want to use this right away to give it to Summer Artoria so that and she has... It comes has... back in six turns. Yeah, but it's more just a protection against uh, her in case she decides to focus in on her. Yeah, maybe. And, and then we so. can potentially go for Jack because Jack is at three and that means she's going to NPS and we have two females on the team. Yep. So I think... I think we need to take care of Jack. Mm -hmm. Or is there calling her here Unborn? Yeah, Unborn. Because she's a... Fetus. Do here. Go here. She's the funky fetus. The one's favorite funky fetus. Do we need to go with his right away? No, right? No, not yet. No. The MP gain is nice, but we don't need it right now. So... There's no arts cards. It's okay. Can... It lasts for three turns, though. So we can at least go here and then two quicks. There we go. You should still be able to do a lot of damage just by yourself. Mana burst. And of course, the thing is, Medea has uh, like an NP charge that gets her all the way to like three, I think. Or yeah, two. it's 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 gonna be very bad when she activates it for sure. We can NP uh, this turn. We could, and that would probably take out our main problem here. Was if if she NPs, it would be a problem, and then if depending on how much damage she does, we can probably get it. So we can try it. Let's try. Uh, use this, or do we want to use this? Just so we have the refund. Okay. Just for the refund. And we don't need to use this right now, right? No. Uh, increase the debuff resistance. That would be nice before Medea did her thing, but we can go here and put this on, and then we'll see how this goes. Hopefully this is enough. Uh, she's MP5. She has 200% attack up and 50% from arts and 50% to arts. Uh, she should be very close to one-shotting it. And if she doesn't one-shot it, she'll be very close, I think. Mm. Even with type disadvantage, she should be... Yeah, see? Ooh. That was the thing that she gives. That's okay, a good now. thing we get to check, Jack, because she's about to get two by the end of this. Yes. Okay. That's the thing that happens when she dies. Okay. It could be a problem. Yeah, but it's she's a perma buff. It, it's per no, it gives it to the entire team. Ooh. Yeah, that's the part where I just I'm suddenly remembered. This is the part where it's actually very bad for us. Imperial privilege. Uh, that really didn't do anything. Okay. I mean, he just did it to laugh at us, to be honest. We don't need to do anything here. So we can loop. 
again on maybe Medea since she's close. Yeah, we can definitely do it on Medea because you'd be close to it, and then we'll figure out what to do with Nero and everyone else. Probably want to get in a hit with Cartoria Caster. Yeah. We can do that. Uh, 40%. Asclepius is pretty in an okay spot. Yeah. Again, I think the thing I remember most is that we just have to not kill Nero. So if she actually spawns in the middle here, that would be the best for us. Either in the middle or the back. But if she spawns in the front, that's going to cause issues. Fence up. Not bad. There she goes. Uh, we also need to deal with Omokasu, because actually Omokasu is the only character that can 100% deal with the buff that uh, Castoria gives. Yes. Because he removes all buffs. Okay, so here's what we gotta try. We gotta try and kill Omakasu. So we gotta go here. Here. And then another arts, because this will guaranteed not kill Nero. Yeah. Okay. Hmm, that'll be a decent refund. Okay. We'll try it. I really don't like not getting two of the uh, of the shield here, but it should be fine. One of the shields is still pretty good. Yeah, and that also removed that debuff that uh, we got from her, so that's also very nice. The minus HP. It's good to remember for when we do this fight again, and it's harder, and we're not using Castoria. Yep. Wow, he barely lived. God, are you fucking kidding me? Well, he's not gonna MP though, so we're fine. At least, but Osmandius is, and he's probably gonna go after either Castoria or Asclepius. Uh, yeah, it's very, very likely to be honest. All right, we're gonna heal. We're gonna use his heal because it seems most likely that he dies. Well, he's gonna be on one. Oh yeah, that's right. He would be okay, and we don't need to use hers yet because it's fine. So I guess we just um, take her out. Take him out, I mean. Yeah, take out him and then use two of these and this should be fine. And we're about to get hit by a... Oh, no. I don't think that was... The... Okay. Okay, thank God. Thank God for the 100% damage up. Um, Crit rate. Yeah. Okay. Let's see who he goes for. He's almost guaranteed to go for us. The rare Ramses Tentirku. Very rarely ever seen. Oh. He went for the worst possible one to go for. Yeah. Nice. The one that still had a shield up. Ouch. Yeah, they're gonna it's gonna be hurdy hurdy now. Ouch. She's almost dead. Okay, okay, but so we now have the NP. We do. So now we do we have the yes we do. Mm, okay, yeah. I think we go here. Go here. I forget his is a AoE. AoE HP restore. And then uh, guts. I think we can to do this. To everyone, but besides himself. Okay. Now here's my question. I really need to figure out who's the one who gives the permanent guts. Is it Nero, or is it uh, Ozzy? Well, she already has the permanent guts. She has three hits of guts. Yeah. I think either way we have to save her for last. I think if we kill him, what I think if we kill her first, she give gut, she gives permanent guts to everybody, which is why we can't kill her. Yeah. So we're gonna have to go with Ozzy first and go for it here. And she's also gonna hit us with an NP, and that is gonna kill. No, we have to it's use an his. AOE. Yeah. We have to use his um. His Victoria. NP. Yeah. That's the only way that uh, Castoria has a chance to survive this. Yep. Hopefully I targeted the right person. Hopefully. I'm pretty confident in her ability to just insta-kill whoever she targets. Okay, yeah, it's uh, Ozzy. Okay, it's Ozzy. <laughs> and now here's where we find out whether or not it was... Oh, he's not going to take any damage anyway. Oh, that's right. He gets a bunch of defense up. Um, and he gets defense up every turn. Yep. So I think we lose. Uh, probably. We'll see. We'll see. But if we don't have a way to... Oh, we do have a way to... No, we don't. I was supposed to say, Asclepius has a way to remove it buffs. Like... Uh, no? Yes? No, he has a way to seal. 
Oh, well, there goes his. There's his. Okay, so let me just see. Super Orion. Just to be sure here. He just activated Imperial Privilege a bunch. That's probably what kept his defense up so crazy high then. Okay, so we have to use this. Because it's always like level 5 and level 10 of each skill. Yeah, do we shuffle? I mean, we have two Buster Orion cards. Do we just go for Buster Orion then? And use all three of his skills? Probably. Okay. Just remember to does hit his, Does his gut stack? Um, it does not stack. No, but you get so crit stars. We do get crit stars. I don't think I want to waste the guts. Because it comes back in, what, eight turns? He will lose his guts by that time. So, no, I don't want to use that. Um, well, beast and demonic. Doesn't really count towards any of them. I guess we'll see. 20 and 40. I guess we really do just gotta bank on. Okay, we're gonna have to do it because we need more critting. Okay. Those are good odds. Yes. Alright. He's not dealing very much damage at all. None of them are. Yeah, we focused probably too much on Nero. I think it was the defense up. Whoever. We still have uh, Mecha Ellie. So, but it's not going to matter because Nero kills him. Nero doesn't do effective damage against alter egos. It's the opposite. She does a neutral. Yeah, she's not going to do anything to her. Yeah. Okay, now his defense is, is gone, so maybe now we have a chance at it? Maybe. Okay, I'm going to activate this and hope for the best. Activate uh, the crit okay. stars, gainer. Do we have the crit stars? On her? This one? Yeah. Okay. She shouldn't- never mind. She's not gonna be able to activate that anytime soon. Okay. Go here, here, here. See how much she goes now. Yeah, it's it was going. just literally the Imperial Privilege that was preventing him from taking damage. God damn, I did not know Imperial Privilege gave that much defense. Oof. Well, he's about to kill someone. We have to just hope that he targets uh, one of the characters with guts. Okay, that's not very good. Wait, that was the dude with guts. He is, but that's the one that we, I would prefer him not to hit. Because uh, now he dies here. Mm. Do we go for... The kill? On Ozzy, or do we attempt to give the minus NP charge? Because she has a chance to decrease MP charge. I guess not we do it. Not guaranteed, though. Okay. If she misses this, then they're dead, and no one is in the back that can kill Ozzy, I think. Yeah, you have to do it. Okay. You have a full Artoria thing right here. I don't know if you want to shuffle. No, I don't want to shuffle. Uh, okay. We have to just hope that she removes the... And we need her to now actually kill... She's going to kill Nero, no doubt. Nope. We're all dead. We needed the, the MP charge to go down and that's going. So it's over now. Because this is going to kill everyone. Except for, uh... Arturia. No, it's gonna kill everyone, and then... Oh no, she doesn't do enough to kill her, okay. So... She, Mecha Ellie, lives. Well, no, there she goes. Oh, there she's okay. back. Well, this now we have Mesh to draw aggro for one turn. Yes, which we can do now. Is I can also take down Ozzy now. As I go here. And next turn she's gonna have her heal. So I think I can go... Target focus. Does she need the defense for right now, or do we want to save that? Uh, it's not bad to have it on her. One time, okay. We'll just the go damage cuts is one time. I forget, is this a permanent? It's, no, uh... Okay. Well, there's no HP left to decrease. Oh yeah, I can't go below. Actually, I don't know. I'm not, I'm not gonna test it right now. 
there's a chance. Now, here's the funny thing. If I'm right on this, and she should hopefully kill. She does not have enough to kill. But we should be able to stall it out with Mash and uh, Saber. Oh, thank God. He missed both buffs at 100, too. Yes. Okay, well, so, you have your buffs back, at least. Okay. Yeah, we're, we're gonna have to kill him. We'll go... Well, uh, here's the thing. Do we go for Mash for an MP2? Not for Overcharge 2? For her... Overcharge applies damage cut. Yeah, I think that'd be better. Because he's gonna die regardless, and she's gonna get plenty from this, so... Yeah. I think that's the way to go. Did you heal? No, I couldn't heal. Because it removes, uh... MP. Yes, exactly. It's actually a very fair skill. She just it makes a lot of NP, so it's better when you have one that's higher. Sure hit. That's the thing that she gets, okay. Now we just have to kill Nero two more times. Three, yep. It should be possible if she actually just kills Mecha Ellie. And then all we have left is Mash and um, Summer Saber, and they can easily just kind of like grind it out. Well, she's going after Mash. She's getting Artoria. She's going to NP. Okay. I think you need a invincibility her. Yep. And then invincibility. Does she have invincibility? No, right? No. Can she actually just? Do you want to just do it? She'll be fine. It was worth a shot to see. Uh, shuffle. We need a shuffle for better cards. That's those are sort of better. <laughs> Those are. I can wait. No, I, I can use it now. It's fine. It doesn't matter if Ellie dies. Um, you can hit with arts and then Buster and then quick. Uh, no. No, Buster because she's she's at 7,000. Okay, whatever. Oh, no. What, how do you want to say arts, Buster, and then quick? or? Yeah, so arts. we can attack her on the, the second guts. Hmm. Okay. We'll see how much uh, Mash would have done. I think Mash would have been able to kill with 7,000. No. Just not. Alright, you were right on that one. Good call. Alright, that should be the end of Mecha Ellie. Uh, and possibly almost all the life of Mash. No, Mash still stays because of the guts. But we'll see who she attacks. Oh, Imperial Privilege. I don't oh. think she actually went for the worst possible target. Uh, you could kill her, I think. <laughs> probably. This MP kills, and then this, these two sweep up. Yeah. Okay. Funny enough, I'm almost positive I also used Summer Saber to beat Nero the first time. Because <laughs> this is bringing back a lot of memories of this fight actually using this team comp. <laughs> well, minus the Mecha Alley, Super Orion. <laughs> Everything else, Castoria. yes. You probably had, like, Waver or something. Yeah, I likely had Waver. Apply all guts for allies. See? That would have been... That's the permanent guts. That would have been the killer if we had gotten it. Alright. That's one Nero down. And now that we see how the team goes, we attempt to team build and see what team we can bring in to fight her again. So, join us next time as we figure out... As we... This is basically the end of the... Oh! Let's go, as this is the end. I don't think I've ever beaten this version of it, Prototype. ever. This version specifically, the original version, I don't think I've ever beaten. I've beaten this version, which is the nerfed version, so. We'll see. Let's see. Uh, see you guys in the next one, in the final one. Say goodbye, boy. Goodbye.